I drove an hour to Altamont, Florida to check out this pre-release at The Collective. This store was crazy. It was gigantic. And we had a ton of fun. Check out everything that they've got. It's got anything that you would want. Cards, Dungeons and Dragons stuff, any type of card game you can even imagine. Check out all these figures. So many exclusive things. The guy across from me even had the same deck box. And then somebody pulled these. It was crazy. All right, let's rip some Paradox Rift. Shout out to the collective in Altamont, Florida. Got a Play Pokemon prize pack. I had two of those today. It's my second one. And this is my second one in total. I've never had them before. We got one, two, three, four, five packs of Paradox Rift, plus four in the building battle. So we've got nine packs in total. Hopefully we can get something because I didn't pull anything at the pre-release. We got the Zatu right here, stamped promo, looking sick. And then we got the Slitherwing Ancient. And the Iron Bundle, Reverse Hollow. Looks pretty sick. I'm liking these Reverse Hollows. Just get a look at the Ancient and Future cards. I actually did pull this in the uh, Play prize pack. See that? It's got a little swirl right there. Really sick looking energy. We got a Hollow Whale Lore too. So hopefully we get something good. We got a lot of stuff to rip. I also was able to pick up these singles at the shop. We got a Dialga V Alt Art. And then we got the Skeledurge SIR. Look at that. Ooh wee, that is beautiful. That is amazing right there. All right, so let's go ahead and rip into the Paradox Rift. I'm gonna open the Play Prize Pack first. These packs are freaking awesome. Uh, they're actually worth the money. All the guys hooked me up with some code cards too. While I was there, they don't use them, so they hooked it up. So let's see what we got. We got a dark patch first. We got a Miriam, okay. We got a Manaphy, that'll be useful. We got a hollow feather ball, that's cool. And a hollow mirage gate. It's actually really, really cool. Well, that would this would be uh, this Mirage Gate. They would love that in the uh, Lost Box decks. Wonder if those are uh, worth anything. I know the uh, Play Prize Packs are like pretty crazy. They're usually like worth something, right? So let's go into the Paradox Rift. There's also another pre-release being held at the Collective tomorrow. It's gonna be at 7 p.m. though, so it's a little late. Um, but I think I'm gonna go to that one and see what's up. Hopefully we can pull something from two pre-releases. Alright, we got a Steel Energy, Porygon, Oricorio, Toad's Cool, Vanellite, Gliscor, Absol, that's a pretty cool artwork for Absol. Simi Sage, Spinda Reverse, Panpour Reverse, and our first hit, check that out, an Iron Valiant. Woo, first hit, first hit, not bad. Not bad, that's actually my first hit total from Paradox Rift. So hopefully we can keep the momentum up. They actually looked out at this pre-release they gave us, we got the building battle, and then they gave us three packs extra for participating. And the the past pre-releases that I've been to, you'll get your building battle, and you'll get you'll get one extra free pack, and then you only get one extra one pack after that per win. And this one they just give you three extra packs no matter what. So I like that. We get more packs like this, which is super sick. 
And they also give away the Play Pokemon prize packs, which are really, really cool. Do we got... Oh, wait, sorry. Do we got something? We got something. We got something. We got something. What is it? A mouse hold. Full art. That is beautiful. I'm loving that card. I'm loving the green on that. That's so sick. Hopefully we can keep this momentum going. Super sick. We're two hits and two packs right now. So hopefully we can get like an SIR. I saw somebody literally get two SIRs. So we got a Nicket, Knackley, and the rest IRs were Roaring Moon and the Tapu Coco, which are like both of the cards that I want so, so bad, which is so crazy. We got a Galisopod Hollow right there. Pretty cool card. I definitely want one of the Parasol Ladies or the Tapu Coco or the Roaring Moon. Or, I did see somebody pull the Iron Hands Full Art and the EX Double Rare. I really want the Iron Hands SIR. That card is beautiful. We got a Fighting Energy, Wiglet, Gliscor, Blip Bug, Fuecoco, Minior. Wouldn't mind getting that Minior illustration rare. Tulip, Porygon Z, Steeny Reverse. And nice! We got the Chantel Full Art. Beautiful. We are getting bangers, ladies and gentle gems. We are getting bangers. We've gotten three cards so far. Um, one, just a double rare, but then two have been literally full art ultra rares, which is not bad. The icing on the cake would be if we were able to pull an SIR. So let's go. We got a Fire, Snow Runt, Hone Edge, Horsey. Joltik, Medical Energy, Steeny, Gliscor, Semipore, Professor, Tur Professor Turo Scenario, and a Low Kicks. I did pull one of those at the event. Alright, let me get these beautiful cards out of the way real quick. Alright, I've got the Build and Battle open. This time we get the Aegislash. Um promo right there which is nice i didn't get the same promo as last time and we've got four packs in here so i'm hoping for an sir truly hopefully we can uh clutch out an sir from this set i haven't gotten super crazy pulls from pre-release so far but obsidian flames was good uh, Paldea Evolved was trash, honestly. I pulled, like, 10 packs. I pulled, uh, one card. I pulled one, one SIR, and then I ended up pulling the same card again, a Quavel. Eveltal, that shine, like, kind of tricked me, but I know all the, uh, every pack has a hollow in these, so, and they kind of do look like that, so that's just why. All right, let's go into the second pack. I mean, honestly, we've gotten three hits already, so that's pretty good. But I'm hoping there's at least something good in this build and battle. Because my first one, like I said, just had nothing. We got Toxel, Spinda, Nimble, Belooza, Chantal, Chantel, Garboder, Pansage Reverse, Zubat Reverse, and a Roaring Moon. That is nice right there. Check that out. Beautiful. We got another hit. So we've gotten four hits so far. By the way, let me know in the comments if you went to pre-release or not. Let me know what your record was. And let me know what you pulled. Um, I only had one win. And the rest were losses. Uh, two losses, one win. But that's alright. It's all in good fun, right? feel like there's a hit in this. Steeny, Semipore, Knackley Reverse, Nimble Reverse. Oh, we got something. And we got the Serena Double Rare. That's a beauty right there. Honestly, this has been jacked. Makes up for me not pulling anything at all in the first BNB. We've got five hits. That's not bad at all. 
Can't wait to go to the second pre-release and see if I can just cake up with this set. Psychic Energy, Miltank, Wimpod, Plusle, Tandem Mouse, Future Bo Booster Energy Capsule, Simisage, Norman, Eveltal Reverse, Magby Reverse, and just a Latios. That is a pretty cool Latios, though. All right, not bad at all, not bad at all. We got the Serena EX Double Rare. We got the Roaring Moon Double Rare. We got the Chantel Ultra Rare Full Art. We got this beautiful green Mousehold Ultra Rare Full Art. And we got the Iron Valiant EX Double Rare. That was crazy. Jeez, that made up for it. Like, like crazy. And of course, we did get the... Uh, Mirage Gate and Feather Ball Hollows from the Pokemon Play prize packs. Thank you so much for watching the video. Go ahead and hit that like button for me. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what poll was your favorite. And let me know if you've been to the pre-release and what your record and what you polled was. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel with notifications on. We'll keep you up to date on everything Pokemon TCG news related. And we'll have plenty more of these fire Pokemon card openings coming soon. I will be attending another pre-release, so stay tuned for that. Thanks so much again for watching, and have a wonderful day.